Hi guys, this is Amber from the Happy Caravan. This is our once a week grocery haul. We are a family of 12 and we live in New York City. This is how much food it takes to feed our family of 12 for a week. We usually shop at Costco, Trader Joe's, and a little grocery store called Little. So here's our food for the week from Trader Joe's. Um, we have tortillas because we make a lot of burritos. Three days a week we have burritos and we have sourdough bread and a couple bags of bagels that we use for our Saturday lunch. Here's some ciabatta rolls. We use those for tuna. We have some kidney beans for chili, coconut milk for a lamb korma, which is an Indian dish we're going to make. And we have um, some pizza sauce. Um, we also have um, some organic corn chips that we use for nachos. We have a couple of potatoes for our lentil soup, some apples because I think my daughter's going to make a puff pastry with some apples. Uh, bell peppers, those are for chili and also for pizza. Some mushrooms, which are for um, our pizza. We have a couple, oh, four bags of carrots because we're going to use it for lentil soup tonight and also for some baked chicken with vegetables on Saturday. Here's our whole wheat couscous. We got some garlic and some potatoes. We're gonna do um, baked chicken and cook some potatoes with it. We have some spring mix for a nice salad with our chicken meal. Um, we have some greens that we use in smoothies and some raw almonds for our lamb korma. We um, have cilantro for our lamb korma as well and parsley for the chicken when we bake it. Um, we have cookies, <laughs> some pumpkin Jojo's because it is October, pumpkin spice cookies and some fig cookies and chocolate and feta cheese for our salads. Um, lentils for lentil soup. We have put salmon in our bagels on Saturday. Um, I love cherries in smoothies, and so that's why we have so many cherries. We have basil because we make pesto on Wednesday. Oh no, on yes, on Wednesday morning. <laughs> and then dill for our bagels that we have with our salmon. And here's the salmon that we have with our bagels. Um, then for our tuna, we have some red peppers. Um, we're gonna have some barbecue chicken on Friday. We put ground or crushed ginger in our beans when we make um, bean burritos. Um, the non bread is for when we have a lentil dish called dal. Um, and then let's see, our mozzarella cheese, that's for when we're having pizza. Um, the pepperoni is for pizza as well. The garlic naan we're going to have with our lamb korma. The green beans we're going to have with um, our barbecue chicken. And the canola oil, well, that's just a staple. You need that. And I like that it's expeller pressed from Trader Joe's. Um, and pizza crust. <laughs> we don't make our own pizza crust because that takes a long time. Sometimes we do, but usually we just buy it and that's how we make our pizza. And then for baguettes, we have those with a couple of our meals um, just to kind of round out the meals. And then puff pastry. My Here's the apple turnovers that Naomi and Pearl made with the puff pastry. Very beautiful, Naomi. Here's our Costco stuff. We got some black beans, four burritos. We have some eggs. We have some pomegranate juice and some olive oil fresh salsa, some yogurt, some blueberries, and strawberries, both frozen, and oranges, a couple of chickens for $30, <laughs> some pine nuts, I think those were also $30, and some, some tuna, some granola, and some honey bunches of oats, some raisin bran, some kombucha, Oh, two kinds of kombucha, um, a leg of lamb, some mangoes, chicken stock, raisin bran, six gallons of milk, some cheese, some beef, lots of bananas, water bottles, baby wipes, tomatoes, and cucumbers, and salad. And from Little, we have some bottled water, some Chips Ahoy cookies, some red lentils, and some jalapeno slices. So this is the last part of our grocery haul. 
We have um, some chicken thighs from Whole Foods and some chilies from Whole Foods. And that's how we keep this family fed. Hello?